We're at Burley Heads National Park and we've never been here before. Isn't it beautiful? Can you hear the waves crashing? It's a beautiful 24 degrees today, so it's not hot, it's not humid. We've got plenty of sunblock on so we don't get burnt and we're taking the walk up to the scenic lookout. So today we're gonna to spend the day looking around Burley because we don't know much about Burley, but everybody talks about how fantastic it is. And to be honest, we usually just drive through when we're heading north or south around the Gold Coast. So let's go have a look. Isn't this spectacular? So we've gone up the hill at Burley Heads National Park and we've come down again. And it's about, I don't know, one and a half kilometres, I guess, to yeah, here. Yeah, So it's not that far at all. No. And it's such a beautiful walk. Yeah. And look at the view that we're rewarded with at the end. It's amazing. It's fantastic. So this is Burley over here and in the distance there's Surfers Paradise and all of this belongs to the Gold Coast. So Burley is about, has about a population of 10,000 people doesn't it? Yeah, thereabouts. It's about yeah. 20 hectares the park isn't it? Yeah, the yeah. National Park here, Burley Heads, is uh, about 20 hectares yeah. and I think the city of Burley which is part of Gold Coast is actually uh, about 10 kilometres square large. That's right. Yeah, but it's just beautiful, isn't it? You might wonder why everybody's sitting around staring out to the sea. Well, Burley is part of the world surfing circuit. So this is where the best surfers can catch the best waves. <laughs> nice place to have a coffee. Look at the teepee made from storm debris. The Jalurgal Aboriginal Cultural Centre has free entry and gives visitors an opportunity to explore the history of the local Indigenous population and browse through the art, artefacts and gifts. A Jalurgal walkabout tour is also available through the National Park for a fee. James Street in Burley Heads has a reputation for having quality boutique shops. It's a great place to get a bite to eat or just to go window shopping. And no, we're not getting fish and chips. <laughs> it's pretty good. Mm.
Well, we just finished our healthy lunch. Yes, it was delicious. Beautiful, opposite the beach, in the park. And no fish and chips. No fish and chips. <laughs> and it's school holidays, so it's really busy here right now, isn't it? Yeah, it's yeah. great though, great atmosphere. Yeah, it is, it's fantastic. And you see all the cafes and restaurants, they're really full. Yeah. And we kind of anticipated that, which is why we brought a picnic, which was nice. Yeah. So we hope you enjoyed our video today. Yep. It was great, wasn't it? Yeah, it was fantastic. It's a beautiful day. It's just 24, 25, just in a really nice breeze. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's funny, you know, for Queenslanders, probably not quite hot enough to go swimming. No, no. But there's a lot of people here from Victoria and New South Wales, like Melbourne and Sydney, and they're really enjoying having a swim at the beach. Yeah. I hope you're staying safe wherever you are, yep. and we'll see you on our next one. Take care, everyone. Bye. Bye.